Bethesda announced today that Skyrim Special Edition has gone gold, meaning its initial development is complete and the game is ready for manufacturing. It also provided some new technical details about the PC and console versions of Skyrim Special Edition. Either way, the game doesn't ask much. The high end only calls for an i5-2400 or an FX8320 and a GTX 780 or an R9-290, none of which are exactly cutting edge. You'll only need 12 gigs of free hard drive space to go along with that. Keep in mind the PC version is free for anyone who owns the game and its three DLC packs. You can also buy the DLC packs you're missing at a discount to get your hands on Special Edition. On the console side, Bethesda shared the file sizes for PS4 and Xbox One, which are actually much larger than on PC. That's especially true in Europe, presumably due to the need to include more languages. The PS4 version will be about 20 gigabytes in the US and around 33 in Europe. For Xbox One, it'll come in around 17 gigabytes for North America and 25 for Europe. Skyrim Special Edition launches on October 28th. The PC version supports mods while the console versions will do so for the first time. Yes, that includes the PS4 version. Special Edition also features a wide array of visual improvements including remastered art and effects, volumetric lighting, dynamic depth of field effects, and more. Those playing on the PS4 Pro when the system launches next month will also be able to play in 4K. And in case you're curious, here are the recommended PC specs for the Special Edition. For more on Skyrim, stay tuned to GameSpot.